At this point, all the glue is dry, and I want to do a final sanding. Um, now we're going to sand these, these edges to make them smooth, knock off all the high spots. Um, you can use some medium grit sandpaper. Um, you'll see that it's sanding down, and you can also just kind of knock off the corners a little bit so they're not so sharp. Um, and then on the legs themselves, remember there's this little piece right here, the little diagonal piece. Um, it's got little tabs that stick up. We want to flatten those down. And you'll see that flattened down there nicely. On the little latch pieces, um, they need to be fairly smooth, um, a loose fit along the fin, because they're going to actually go right there on the fin. Um, so if they're if they if they feel tight, that one feels good. Okay, this one feels tight. Doesn't want to go on all the way. Um, now you have to sand on the inside of the uh, of the wood. I just doing that. And it's got to it's got to go all the way to the little notch where the little cross beam goes. Okay, that's much better. And then when you get everything sanded, um, bring out your gloves, bring out your um, wood stain, and then go ahead and stain everything a second time um, because this is where it will get nice and dark and it will hide all the wood grain. So I'm going to go ahead and start sand, finish sanding and, and uh, putting on the wood stain. And it's pretty simple to do. Um, just paint it on like you did before and let it dry. Don't forget to get inside of those little cutouts. And remember to do the edges this time. Before we didn't do the edges.